All right. We're back. So, the last episode, uh, we got kind of the outline laid out, I guess, sort of. Um, one thing that I did want to do after looking at it from above is to reduce the overall length by five blocks. So, I think we're going to go and do that. All right. So a lot of the stuff over here, I'm going to have to break down because, you know, it already like built it out and everything, but me, you know what I mean? Okay. So we're going to take uh, this guy down and I'm not going to have enough room for all this. So there's two, three, four. Yep. Kind of figured. Um, and we're going to have to go like one more. So we'll take these. Um, yeah, and then this one will be five. Okay. So now from here, going diagonally, we're going to end up kind of going like right along there. So I don't know how this tower is going to function with all that. But, um, yeah, that's, that's kind of where we're at. So uh, now I need an angle. Okay. And another one. Okay, and then, oh, nope, not you. Uh, four, go up and place some blocks. And um, bo 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 we need to go this way. Nope, that way. Nope, yep, okay. Okay, so then we have that. And then we need to put in block here. Um, I still have 253 plates. So I've got, I've got a lot of plates, man. A lot of plates. Okay, so that can go there. And then we need to get rid of this guy here. And then throw in that guy there and there. And then throw in another guy over here. Okay. And then over here, we'll take out five of these blocks. So one, two, three, four, five. And that's where we're gonna go over there. So hopefully that'll give us more of an octagonal shape, which is kind of what we're going for. Okay, so we'll place all of these things down. Okay, so uh, what do I wanna get done in this particular episode? Um, I do want to get uh, sort of an assembler building built. And then uh, one thing that I do want to do is start looking at the tiered stuff um, and seeing what I can do with that. Do I have enough room? Barely. Okay. So what we're going to do is we're going to fill this out because this is where it's going to go. And then those will get all filled up and then I've got more room to take these things apart. Okay. Do, 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 do. Is that is that too loud? I'm gonna turn it down a little bit. It's a little loud. That's better. Okay. Um oh hey I'm full again. Okay, so we'll just build this out and then put in all of these pieces. Did I miss this one? No, I got that one, okay. And then we'll have enough to do this. All right. And then we can start filling in all of this area. Um, I am going to have to get uh, some piping into here. So I may actually end up having to uh, expand um, the tunnels under here and get one to kind of go out this way. So, I mean, it wouldn't be like the most difficult thing in the world to do, but it would be kind of annoying. But... <clears throat> So we do have uh, our kind of landing bay, right? And we have that one uh, tube that goes down there and that does actually go down into the sewer area. So we can actually, and then that, like from the sewer that went this way, that went that way. 
Um, so we can actually go off of that same junction and then go this way uh, into here somewhere. Um, but if I'm going to do that, I'm going to want to put some drills in there and have them kind of do their thing because that should build uh, out, you know, pretty well. Um, yeah, so uh, we have to do some prep work. So we'll go ahead and do that. And what is that shooting at? Is there a meteor shower or something? I mean, I don't see any enemies, except for that one right there. <sighs> I don't know. Uh, one of these days, I'm going to build something that I can go up there and start shooting at those things. And hopefully, you know, you know, get a couple of them, I guess. Okay, so we do have this guy. And so this goes uh, directly underneath um, the landing area, uh, the drone bay. So uh, what we're going to do is we're going to break this off over here. And I'm probably not going to have enough room in my inventory. So let's drop some of this stuff off. Um, okay. So what I need to do... Oh my gosh. That is, that is a deep hole. <laughs> Uh, fun times. Okay, so uh, let's get this guy going up. Um, let's see, that's going to be pistons. The vertical pistons, we're just going to bring them all the way up to the top pretty quickly. Have them come on up. And then, uh, while this thing is, you know, still kind of spinning around a circle, which is what it's supposed to do, um, should I have it spin a little bit faster? I think I want to have it spin a little bit faster. But yeah, so now we're back up to the top. Uh, rotor, if I could type. Uh, drill pit rotor. Uh, we're going to increase the speed, because I think it's 0.5. Yeah, so we're going to increase this to 1. Have this whole thing spin a little bit faster. Um, okay. And then we're going to take these horizontal rotors, and we're going to have them kind of push outward. So, or not rotors, but pistons. You know what I mean. Okay, so these things I'm going to have move at, oh, but uh, we need maximum distance to go all the way out. And then we're going to put this at 0 0.001. And I'm hoping that's going to be slow enough that we can actually dig out. Is that even moving? I mean, we could probably go a little bit faster than that, but... Actually, no, maybe that's good because we can just kind of let that go for a while and just kind of like ignore it. Okay, anyways, uh, yeah, so going back over here. Okay, so we're going to be pushing straight through there. And uh, how we want to do it. Hmm. I mean, I'm going to have to dig some of this out manually, but I don't want to do that too much because I do want to get the materials. So, and actually, I kind of want to cover this up too. Do, 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 do. Uh, one more. There we go. And we'll just have this kind of fill in. That way it looks a little bit more like it's supposed to. And then I'll probably go through here and like paint these things like once I figure out what color I want them to actually be. Okay, so what we need in here initially is two blocks for the piston and then three blocks for um, for the drills. So what we're going to do is we're going to go straight up and start digging this thing the F out. Okay, and then we'll dig in here and dig over here and dig out this corner. And then I'm digging up uh, this top section first uh, because that's going to be the most important thing. So all of this to build the assembler building thing. And then uh, I also want to, I think I already said this, but I think I want to use the tiered assembler. You know, at least go to tier two and see what that kind of looks like. Um, but yeah. 
work in progress, I guess, you know. All right, so let's go out a little bit more. Okay, so now let's get these. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey there, bud. Regular block, please. Okay, so two will get us to the edge here, so we need to go out to at least three. Okay, so we have to clear to that edge. And that can go there. Okay, so let's dig that out. And we actually want to go a little bit beyond that edge because the drills are super picky and I'm just going to have to. Okay, and then we'll get this kind of dug out. Okay, so we got kind of this top portion done. So we need to get all the way out to here. And I need to make sure that there is nothing left. Okay, so that should be good. Um, I need to make sure there's nothing left within this block space at all. Because otherwise those drills aren't going to want to be put in here. Okay, so that should be okay. And then we'll get, dig out this little middle section here. Okay, and then over here on this block, I only need to go out a half block, or dig in a half block, I should say. Um, this guy I don't need. All right. And then we'll go out over here as well. Okay, so now we need to go into this area. Okay, and do, 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 do. there we go. Okay, so we need to dig that out a little bit. And go all the way to the corner. There we go. And then we can build that wall out. So this is all completely cleared now, as well as this. Okay. Nope. Okay, and then we'll dig this out, and then we'll dig out that corner. Okay. And we are almost ready to be doing this thing. It's going to be great. Okay, so let's put in the bottom corner here and see what more we need to do. Okay, <clears throat> and this is going to have to get dug out a little bit. So this is like kind of straight all the way across here. So this knob is going to have to be dug out. Uh, this is probably going to have to get dug out. And I think the rest of this is good. Okay. Now, should I put... Why? Why? Okay, seriously, what? Can you turn off the fucking thing, please? Thank you. It's like I'm hitting buttons and it's not just not doing anything. Okay. So we've got this all built out. This should be enough to build our drills. Um, I should probably eliminate this last sec. I mean, honestly, I could probably eliminate all of this uh, just to make sure that those can go in there properly. But. I'm not worried about that right now. So, okay. So now we need our drill. Okay, and we'll get rid of that. Okay, so, okay. So it looks like these can be placed in here. Um, I need you to go this way. I need you to go this way. Okay. Oh, okay. So it looks like they all can actually fit in there. So that's that's great. So I didn't have to get rid of anything. So uh, now I need just a shit ton of steel plates. And it's I probably used up all the steel plates to build the area, the floor in the area where I'm going to be putting the assembler. So that's probably what happened with that. How are we doing over here? You are like barely moving. Um, okay, so let's go into the pistons here. Okay, so drill pit, horizontal pistons. We need both of these. They are both selected, right? Yeah. Okay. Uh, velocity, we're going to point to 0, 0, 0.5. 
Um, so that's five times the speed of what they're moving right now. But I mean, this thing is spinning around fast enough that, you know, we should be, should be good. Okay. How we doing? What do we need? Large steel tubes? I can get you some large steel tubes. Uh, we'll make a thousand of them. Why? Because I have a shit ton of material and I don't have to worry about any of that, which is great. Um, okay, so this is... I mean, these are drills, but... Hang on. Let's look these up. Okay, so it's all of these. So this is... Passage drills. Okay, so that should be six. Yeah, that's six. Okay. So we're going to call those the passage drills um, because that's what they're doing is they're, you know, digging out a passage. All right. Uh, what do you need? You need a shit ton of plates, which means that the floor over there is probably closer than what I've got, or closer than these are which doesn't seem like it should be, but maybe it is. I don't know. Me. And you're making these first? Why are you making these first? I don't need any more of those. I need these. You're going to flip that up, change it up, move it around. What are you going to do? I mean, I probably don't need that many, so we can just get going on this. Okay. Um, so while that is doing its thing, uh, something we can do is we can actually cycle the battery pill and I can show you how that works. Um, and then in order to do that, we're going to need like 1600 power cells to be made because uh, the 20 batteries that are in the pill that we're going to be, you know, basically destroying. Um, yeah, cause I think these are all like dead in here. So and we've got a decent amount of stuff in there. Uh, we do not need to go into the actual pill area. Um, other than to just, you know, verify that these are all dead, which, you know, it looks like they all are. And then we can look at the top ones here, and it looks like those are all dead. And we can go into here and check out these ones, and it looks like these ones are all dead. So I can assume that the ones on the bottom are also dead. So, uh, how this is going to work, well, first I need to check power cells. Um, do I have access to any kind of inventory? Yes, I do. Okay. So power cells, we don't have anywhere near enough. Like nowhere near enough. Okay, so 180 and we need 1600. So that's going to be 1420. So there's 1420. And I need you to build the plates first, man. Can you, can you just keep building the plates? Okay. Uh, anyways. So what we're going to be doing here is this is already kind of locked into one position. So what we do is we reverse the grinders and get them all nice and even. Oh, another thing that I don't have in here yet is uh, the connection from here to there. Um, so once we grind all this stuff, I mean, it's all just going to be stored in the drills, which I can't then reuse, which is kind of important. So uh, we're going to be digging down here, kind of digging a hole. All right, and then we're just going to go straight over here, straight as we can, uh, without breaking the blocks, if I can help it. And then, okay, so what is this? This is in that uh, tunnel. Yep. Okay. So now we're here. So this is good. Uh, we can kind of clear this out a little bit. Um, I do actually kind of want to dig this out and put like a nice little floor in here. Okay, no, no, go down. There we go. And then get that down a little bit, get that down a little bit that down a little bit okay so that'll get us over to here and so let's whoa no turn off okay just wasting hydrogen over here it's ridiculous okay so we've got this and now we can throw in 
just for now. Uh, does that, will that allow us to get out of here? Is that a thing that I can do? Yes, it is. Okay. So now we need to get over here. So we basically need to get to this point and then over to that point. So we can start drilling through here. Oh, oh. please don't break anything. Did I damage something? I felt like I damaged something. Okay. So now we've got this tube here, or junction, I should say. Okay, and then we've got to get, uh, let's see, we need to go straight this way, so about there, I think. No, do not break this, please. <sighs> okay, so that will get us there. So we can kind of get this kind of going a little bit, I guess. Um, yeah. Oh, wait, no, you're, you built the wrong thing. Don't build that. I need you to build this and that and this underneath me. Okay. And then we can throw that kind of down on the side and then kind of drill out the corner here. That should be okay. <clears throat> really? Didn't I just sit down in the chair like five minutes ago? Like, what the hell? I run out of power so quickly. It is ridiculous. Okay. So we've got our thing there. We've got our thing here. Um, so that can go there. And then this needs to go kind of here. Okay. And then I need to get out of here so I can recharge. Do, 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 okay. Yes, I know I left the door open. I know I left both doors open. I know that I'm venting heat, but at least I'm not venting oxygen, so it's all good. Okay, so back into here. All right, so what we basically need to do now is to get these down and in here. I don't have any interior plates, so I do need to get some of those. Um, okay. Do, 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 do. Oh, we'll just go into here. Okay. Interior. Okay, so you don't need. Uh, you will take a bunch of those. Okay. All right, so we'll hop down here, and then this guy needs to be taken out. No. Seriously? Okay, fine. Drop the plates over here. Pick up these plates over here. Throw in a junction box. There. Okay. So now we're good. All right. And then I need to do a corner coming down out of here, facing towards me. And towards me. And then we need a tube. Straight to. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, dude. You put that in the wrong place. I'm like, how does that not, how is that not the same as the other one? Okay. <clears throat> Anyways, so uh, tubes, tubes, right? We got all the tubes. Um, do I want to make this like a full like corridor or do I just want to like leave the ice kind of here? I mean, I kind of I like having the ice here actually, honestly. I mean, I could throw some plates on here to just kind of like eliminate or to create a floor, I should say. So you can go there and 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 there and then it'll just look amazing. Hang on, I think I hear something outside. So it turns out it was just geese, like a, like a lot of geese. Um, okay. So we have this whole thing kind of going on right here now, sort of, kind of. Uh, right. So what's going to end up being put in here is a conveyor junction. So we are going to throw these tubes into here. Okay. So then that will connect 
all of that. And then I need to get out of here and then also be able to take that out. Oh, good, it came out. And then we need to go into a conveyor junction. I have no idea if that's the right way, but we'll make it turn that way just in case. Okay, so that will all build and we will be gravy. So now we need to go with the half block. There we go. <clears throat> okay, so that is what that's gonna look like um, once everything is kind of all, all kind of built. Um, we should be able to see it built once it gets over there. Yes, okay. So now our welders are all connected and we can fill that out ourselves. And now it's like you never even knew that it was there. Um, do I have that door open too? I do not, okay. So we'll close this door because once again, we don't actually need to be in there with the battery pill. Um, okay. So now we can go into here and those are all down. So we're gonna be grinding out those batteries and these only need to be on for like five or 10 seconds. It's not gonna take very long. So if we can go down here and kind of watch. So they will take down just the batteries here. Actually, it's taken a little bit longer than I expected. Okay. And you'll see that they don't actually break down anything else, but we are left with the projection there. So that is exactly what we want. So we're gonna turn that off. We're gonna move the grinders back up. And then we're going to reverse the pill. And now you'll see that we've got uh, all of these uh, projected in here, exactly where they're supposed to be. And then once this is in place, we lower uh, the grinders again. And then once they're in place, and you do have to make sure that they are in place because if they're angled up, they will break apart uh, this curved piece. And then we'll turn them on again, have a look. Okay, so that's that. And we just turn these off and we put the grinders back up. And that's it, that is how the pill works. Um, yeah, and with the build and repair system, it will build these on its own. If you did not use the build and repair mod, uh, you would need welders. So you could go a little bit slower, have welders on this side and have grinders on that side or something like that. Or you could do take the pill and stack it vertically and then have grinders on one side and then on the other side have like welders and then you can still spin around you know 90 degrees and then it'll grind out one and weld the other so there there is a way to do this um, but this is the system here and the only materials that this needs is stone you take stone you break it down you get nickel silicon and iron and that's exactly what we need to build the power cells so real easy system and then, of course, as this thing gets built, uh, these guys are still uh, recharging off of everything. So 27%, 28%. So then once we get this all built back up, um, they'll start draining from this again. And yeah, it's it, we end up with a net positive and the only thing that it costs is stone. So it's pretty great. Pretty, pretty great. Okay. So uh, now we need to go back down. And then, well, actually, should I deposit whatever materials I have that I don't need? That'd probably be a good idea. So like this and that and that, I don't need any of that. Um, and then these I'll throw in the hab. Do, 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 do. Okay. And then we'll recharge as long as we're over here. Okay, so gray water, and then organics can go there. Okay. And how am I on food actually? So I've got two of these left. So yeah, I think I'm I think I'm pretty good. Alrighty. So yeah, that was uh that was pretty simple. Um, I'm sure if you wanted to, you could probably set up like a timing block to do all of this. So we just hit the go button and it goes through and does its thing and then it will stop itself. But, you know, while I could do that, I'm, I'm I just don't care that much. <laughs> 
I just don't care that much. So doing it manually is kind of cool too because you're kind of more involved in the process. Okay, and then how are you doing? Are you actually, okay, good. So you're actually digging out now. So we're getting lots and lots of stone here. Okay, so we've got these guys going. Okay, so groups and passage drills, and we're gonna turn those on. And then this guy, we're going to move out at point one. And then hopefully that didn't break those last blocks um, because I think the drill heads were right up against those. Um, hopefully not, we'll find out. But yeah, so we'll just push this thing through here, getting lots and lots of stone. I'm not even close to worried about not having space for everything because with those six large uh, containers that I put over there, I'm just not even worried. And then while that's doing its thing, um, I want to take a look at how many plates we have left over. Hey, do the scrap first, man. Do the scrap first. Do the scrap first. I could change the order that uh, the build or the script thing does this. Uh, there's an option in there to do the scrap first. Um, once again, I just I don't care that much. Okay, so I'm looking for plates. Uh, not those ones, though. Okay, we got 741 left over. We have a lot of power cells. So as those batteries are getting built, um, we should be seeing that drop. But that also depends on if it's building more plates. So or more of the armor blocks. So I, I don't know what's going on right now. Um, I just know that I am drilling out another passage and that it is now completed apparently. Okay, so uh, now we have to do the hard work of getting this thing to be able to reset. And by reset, I mean like disconnect it, add another piston, then reconnect it and have it do that whole song and dance. You know what I mean? So, go ahead and do that, and then we need the blocks on the side, and we need to do the corners, of course, which means that this one probably does not need to be there yet. Okay, remember, always do the corners first. It'll save you time, save you headaches, and just makes everything easier. Okay, so we'll throw that on there. And then we'll throw this on here, and then we'll put this across the top. Uh, if it will let me. Is that a thing that I can do? I know I saw you on here. Come on, I know you're green. There we go, right? Mm, right there, okay. Okay, so now with this, uh, we can take this guy down, which is probably not gonna be fun, but meh. Okay, so that'll turn all of those off, and now I need to add in two pistons, which I already have on my bar. Okay, so there's one, and there is two. Grind that part off, and then wait for these guys to build, and then we'll see about, see if we can reconnect. So the good thing about doing it this way is that these blocks well, one, these will fit exactly in between um, all of these blocks thanks to the reworking of the, uh, the hit boxes for these things. Um, the only bad thing is the reconnecting here. Like, these cannot move whatsoever. Like, maybe they can move back and forth this way, but they cannot move side to side whatsoever. So when I move this thing over to here, it has to be exact. Otherwise, the whole thing breaks and it's just terrible. Okay, so we'll move that out. And we need to make it so that way this edge right here lines up exactly with this face. At least I think that's how it's gotta go. Um, I don't think there can be any 
uh, deviation or anything like whatsoever. So okay, a little more, a little more, a little more. Okay, so we went a little too far in, so we clipped a little bit. So we're gonna bring it out. Okay, I think that should be okay. Yeah, I think that should be okay. So now we have to hope that we can get this. Uh, please don't blow up. Okay. Whew. So worried about that. Okay, so uh, we're going to call this one Passage Piston 2. And then we're going to call this one uh, Passage Piston 1. And then we're going to go into the K menu, grab both of these guys. So this and this, and then we're going to extend these out at, let's see, I did 0.1 before, so we'll do 0.05 because we have two pistons. Did I do that wrong? Passage piston. Okay. We're at 0.1. Okay. We're at point one. Okay. So I think it's these. Oh, I have two. That was weird. The sound just changed. Um. Yeah. So I've got too much junk in here. So give me, give me something that I can actually put stuff into. Uh, most of the stuff is full. Refineries, whatever. That one's full. That still has eight hundred fifty-nine thousand stone in it. It's pretty crazy. Um, do, 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 do. Hydroponics farms, cargo bay container. Okay, so this guy right here. We're going to throw in all of this stuff. Um, and then we're going to throw in that. Okay, so the issue here is I think this is kind of stuck on these. And it is bouncing a lot. Okay. So hopefully this is now moving outwards. It's hard to tell. I think it is. Okay. Oh, are we moving now? We are not moving now. Please don't like, oh my God. That's what I said. I said, don't do that. And what did it do? It did that. Whenever something is stuck and clanging like that, do not get close to it. It's just a bad day. But is it free? No, the whole thing just blew up. Great. Yep, there I am. Dead. <sighs> so dumb. Okay, seriously, like, what are you... What? What? <sighs> And that is now disconnected, and these things are, I, have no, I don't even know what these things are doing. Okay, are you even like alive right now, or are you broken? No, you're good, you're good. Are you still moving? Yeah, so it just blew up the head that's on there. Which I suppose isn't too big of a problem, but the thing is I cannot get this on here because you cannot put the actual piston heads in there. And of course these have stone, so I have to get all of this out. <sighs> so annoying. Is there like a... No, there isn't. Okay, whatever. Um, storage inventory? Is that a thing? I think I can do that. Okay. So I have to... Basically, I have to rebuild all of these drills because the piston head broke off. Probably my fault. Okay, why are you... Can we just get all the stone out of here? Am 
I full already? What, what's going on? No, you're just not connected. Ah, this is annoying. Okay, seriously, can we just, just work with me here? Don't need you, don't need you. I swear, I've died more from Clang than anything else. Okay, go and show me what you have in your inventory, please. Nothing in that one. Okay, I thought I already took out of that one. Whatever, I don't care. And in here, okay. So that should be everything out of the drills. And now I need you to put your piston head back on. I need to take these things apart, which is gonna be a pain. So yeah, I think what my issue was um, is that I didn't stop the pistons when I was trying to free the, uh, the stuck drills. Um, so they were still trying to push through and didn't really work that well because it was like clanging and like, I mean, I'm, I'm assuming that this thing was probably pushing through the drill. Like it was, you know, you know what I mean? And so dumb and then as soon as i freed it just a little bit because of the way space engineers works with clang um these things right here are super erratic so they were probably bouncing around like this like constantly and so then when i got close enough it was like being hit by a bullet train and you know you get hit by a bullet train and it tends to hurt a little bit <sighs> okay so I think that I've died four times in this playthrough so far. So the first one was when I wasn't paying attention to uh, my power and I was in the drill hole for the first base, uh, the one that's on the hill. And I lost power, which then means that I lost the light and I didn't have any lights in there so I couldn't see anything. And I didn't have my hydrogen tank on me so I only had like one inventory like one shot to get out of there and I got stuck. So then ended up dying. And the second time that I died was when I was getting gold with uh, um, with the gopher. And I was down there getting gold, getting everything. I didn't see that there was an enemy overhead and that they had sent the drone. And then by the time that I got up and got into the gopher, the drone was already on me and, you know, I had turned off the thrusters uh, on, on the gopher because I was dumb at the time, I guess. But, yeah. So, yeah, I uh, got killed by an enemy there. Super fun. And then I died from Clang. Uh... I don't remember where I died the first time from Clang. Was it down here? No, no, no. I think it was over there with that that passage drilling system. I think I died from there, and then I died again over here on this passage drilling system. So, yeah. I'm doing really good. Unable to play. What do you mean you're unable to place the drill? Is there, like, scrap in there? What are you doing? Do I have to just like get rid of all of this stuff? Is that what's going on right now? Is that what you're gonna make me do? Because you're dumb. I mean, I'm pretty sure there's like no scrap over there, so it's gotta be these blocks. But I was I was able to place them before without having, you know, having all of the blocks up there, but now it's like, I don't, I don't know. I don't know what's going on, man. Nothing's working. Okay, can I place you? I can place you. Can I place you? I cannot place you. Is it those corner pieces that's doing it? I mean, 
And it shouldn't be an issue, honestly. Wait, wait, am I sharing the inertial tensors on here? That is probably another thing that messed everything up, because I didn't have the inertial tensors on. So that probably didn't help at all. Okay, seriously. Is it is it really those freaking corners up there that are causing all the issues? That is so dumb. Okay, so I know next time not to do the corners. I'll just do one in the middle up here, one on the side here, one on the side there, and then one in the middle down here. I won't do any corners. <sighs> Actually, do it, is that drill built? It is built. Can I put... Hang on. Yeah, I can just move directly into there. Okay, so let's get this guy and get that guy all broken out. And this one. Okay. So there's no blocks in the way now, right? Right. Okay, so I can I should be able to place this drill, right? Wrong. Wait. You need to be facing the right way first. Okay. And then I can place all of these. So we'll get those built. <sighs> this is way too much work, man. Uh, another thing that I'm going to have to do while this thing is kind of pushing forward, hopefully it will be able to push forward. I'm really hoping it will be able to push forward. Um, is I've got to mark out where the rough middle area of the assembler building is going to go. Um, so that way I can figure out how far I've got to dig this passage. So once we get the drill, we're down to 1% power in the base. What's going on? That's ridiculous. Anyways. Okay, how are we doing? Are you like, what's what's going on here? Let me help you. Okay, so we'll take all the drills, put them all together, passage drills, and turn them on. And then these are the passage pistons, so we're going to take both of these guys and we're going to move them ahead at 0 0.05. Are they moving? They are moving. Okay. So now with that done, um, let's go and mark where that building is going to go. Do, 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 do. And we are at 47 minutes. All right. Um, where am I going? I need to go this way. Okay. So I'm going to put it kind of like centered about right here. So, G okay, work with me here. GPS, um, assembler building. Okay, so that's that. Uh, now we just need to go down here. And then we'll drop down. Okay. Okay, now how far do we have to go? 27 meters? Okay, and then uh, I'm going to place uh, some plates as that thing goes. I don't know if it'll be a good idea or a bad idea, but it is an idea. Um, just grab a few. All right, so that can go, that can go, and that can go, and then, I mean, I should be able to put that there, right? Shouldn't affect too much. Yeah, should be fine. Okay. I mean, and these things still have a ways to go, so not really too worried about it. Drink of the day is a very watered down because the ice melted. Uh, Mountain Dew Baja Blast from Taco Bell. Um, I was going to get Gatorade, and that would have been the drink of the day, but they were out, so I had to settle, unfortunately. 
Okay, so maybe I only need like these top ones because this thing shouldn't move side to side. It should just, you know, tip down once I take the piston off. Um, so maybe we'll try that. And that should hopefully be enough to make this whole thing work. Maybe, maybe not, I don't know. Um, and we still need, oh hey, we're actually almost directly under it already. So yeah, maybe once this is all done, I won't need to extend this again at all. And because the assembler building is close to the edge of the wall, um, I'm not gonna build out any farther because if someone was, well, okay. So first, if someone knew that this was down here, then they could dig their own tunnel and maybe find a way to kind of tap into my stuff and they could steal all of it without actually having to attack the base, which would be bad. Okay, so where are we? Okay, yeah, so we are under the assembler building, so we are good to go. Um, we'll turn all of these guys off. Okay. And yeah, I mean, at this point, we can just take them down. Just kind of take everything apart, get it done, I guess. Um, go back into here, and then we'll store all of this love in this. Okay, and then we'll get that. Okay. Take that out. Oh, whoops. I was not paying attention. Okay, give me those. Thank you. All right, and then we'll take down this one. Do, 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 do. Wow, those turrets are going crazy up there. Okay. Okay, making progress slowly but surely. Can I get at that one? Yes, I can. But I cannot move or double click to move through this particular one, which is fine. Okay. And we'll throw that in there, and then we'll get you broken down. And then we'll get this guy broken down. And then this guy. And we need to drop some stuff off. Uh, bu bu bu. Let's go into this one. And then we'll take out this guy. Okay, so that's that. Um, so we'll go and throw this into there. Uh, and then I'm gonna need some plates. Plates, okay. We have 3,000 plates, wow. Um, yeah, uh, also interior plates. Uh, interior. Okay. So now we just gotta build this out and then figure out, yeah, so probably about right here. So we could come up basically on this block here. So we'll throw one out here and then that will be where we go up. And then because the three by two drills drill out such a nice space, um, it actually makes this real easy. Okay, and then that will be the end wall. Do, 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 do. Okay, and then get the corner in. There we go. And then we can get the rest of this in. 
This is probably going to use up way more than the 3,000 plates that I've got available, but it's all right. Okay, and then we'll get uh, this corner in here. I mean, that one's got to go there anyway, so I don't really care too much. And I'm out of steel plates. Okay. Um, do, 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 do. Okay, so let's get this going. And then we need to get that corner in there and that corner in there. One, two, three. Get that corner in there. Drop that down. And then we'll do this corner. Okay. And then that will actually kind of center itself perfectly in the end here. So this was a perfect length uh, for this particular section of the sewer to be. So that worked out quite nicely. Um, I wasn't expecting it to work out that nicely. It just kind of did. So yeah. There's all that. And then we can throw in these ones to kind of clear off of that. And now we just need this to go this way. Do, 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 do. OK. And then we'll do that and that. OK, so this section of sewer is all done. And we need to get up there. So let me try to get as close to the center in here as I possibly can. Um, yeah, I think that'll work. And then this will be uh, GPS tunnel location. I don't know. Call it something. OK, so that should be directly in the center there. So now we just need to run some pipes. And then straight pipes is all we need. Apparently, I'm low on energy again. OK, and then we need to go up this way. OK, so now the way that I'm going to do this is I'm going to kind of build as I'm dropping down so that way when I dig out this final part, I'll just drop down and I'll already have tubes up there that I can connect to. And we're at 58 minutes, so once we get that done, we'll call this video um, complete. Should be fun. Do, 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 do. First thing we got to do though is recharge. So we will hop in here, do the thing. And then I do want to check the pill to make sure that all of those batteries are built as well. Um, hopefully they've all been built. How are we looking? I uh, can't see. Okay. Uh, they're not building. Oh! Because I don't have the uh, the build and repair system set to build new. Okay, that's what the issue is. No big deal. Okay, so we got to go here in this block right here. Okay. All right, so this is where we're going down. Um, and then, like I said, we're going to build down as we drill down. So that way, hopefully... It works out pretty nicely. Okay, uh, let's go down again. Go down again. Okay, so first thing we're gonna put in here is a junction. And then we'll dig down. Okay, and then we'll throw in a tube. Uh, straight tube. Straight tube, thank you. And then we'll dig down again. 
And then we'll do another straight tube. If it will fit. Will it fit? Or am I in the way? I can't tell. I mean, it looks like I'm in the way, but I guess I'm just below it. Okay. Okay. And now we are where we need to be. Okay. And now I should be able to jump up and place something in there. Yep. And then we'll just use a corner for this. Yeah. Perfect. So that will connect in through here. And then once all that is done, uh, all of these should turn green. Do, 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 do. Okay. And then turn green. There we go. Everything's green. Okay. And then we just have to wait for this kind of to build. And then it's got its whole thing going on. So we should be good there. And uh, yeah. I'm going to go over to where the assembly assembler building is going to be, and we will end it there. So that way I can remember what we're going to do in the next episode. So fun times, right? And then also one more thing that I want to do. Uh, build and repair. Okay. So you, I would like you to build new. There we go. And now it should be building these batteries. Hopefully. Um, I think batteries are a higher priority than blocks or anything. So, I mean, it looks like this is built. I don't, I don't know. I don't know what's going on, man. Anyways, uh, yeah. So ending over at the assembler building. And there we go. We are connected through our sewer system to right here, which I think will work out decently for our assembler building. And we should be good to go. So uh, that's the episode. I hope you guys enjoyed. And I will see you next time. Bye.